Game. Really happy with their performance, um, with the attitude and, and the mentality that the team showed. I think we were on top of the game. Um, it was about being patient and um, and the goal would come because we were deserving that. Um, but we had to avoid mistakes and uh, we made an error. It cost us a game. But even though um, that happened, I think the team showed uh, that against adversity, Gabby individually, how he continued to play, it, and the team, and obviously with the support that we have in the stadium right now, makes things much easier. And uh, the team deserves to win. It's as simple as that. How important is it for, for when the player makes a quite bad mistake and bounce back and have such an important influence on the game? It's just the reaction of everybody after the goal straight away. The reaction of the stadium uh, just gives support to that player, belief, and then the player has to show courage to continue playing. This is part of football. Mistakes are part of it, and, uh, and it's going to continue to happen. But it's about how you respond to that, and I'm really pleased. And uh, it's not a coincidence because Gabi, the way he changes mentality and the way he approaches now every single day is different to a year or two ago. Because there an argument he shouldn't have been put in that position in the first place, and the ball should have gone down the line. Or that's clear. <laughs> and what, what has changed in his approach? And how he looks after himself every day. What is the most important thing in his life, apart from his uh, little daughter and his family, um, and how consistent he is every day in, in his habits, and um, and how much he really wants to, to become to the, one of the best. Mikel, what's the significance in responding to being a goal behind, which was quite problematic quite a lot last season? And do you think it shows that this team is you grown, grown up, we have more alternative. I think we have matured as well. And playing in front of these supporters helps because they are driving you as well. And um, and then it's about belief. A lot of that is about belief and confidence that you can do it and really belief that you can you can do it. And now we have that belief. You've spoken a lot about the supporters and that connection right, right from the most your first day. But it was almost, do you think it was something you consciously felt you needed to generate? Because that atmosphere out that way, you think? I don't know top teams, uh, winning teams, that they don't have that connection with um, with the club, with their supporters. And I just had a person that I really like and love, I would say, uh, that I haven't seen for a while. It's the first time he's been at the stadium for two years, and he said he's the best he's seen ever uh, since he was at Highbury. So, well done. Um, Marcel Ergaard was really good today. Was that the kind of performance that sort of showed why you chose to give him the captain's armor? Influence, and in difficult moments, take the ball and make things happen and that's what he's done. Right, we'll move on.